Hi, Danny here from GDL. Uh, today I'm going to show you on a Jeep Grand Cherokee how to remove this wiper cowling and this uh, artificial firewall. It gives you heaps more access uh, to do pretty much anything in the engine bay of a Jeep Grand Cherokee. You need to do this to uh, do the oil cooler in the valley of the V6 or if you're doing anything on the back of the diesel engines where the turbo is or the coolant hose in the valley. So, first up, you just remove this. Just kick this off. things there. That's off. Uh, then there's two of these. You just unscrew these by hand. Pull them forwards. There's some little lugs here. And that's off. Same on the other side. Uh, that one's not locked in. Beautiful. Okay, then you need to take your wipers off. There's these little plastic uh, caps on the top. Don't break them. Uh, these are a 15 millimeter, which I've got here. Partially, not all the way. Then this top piece of cowling, there's a couple of clips on either side. I've already pulled this one out. Uh, they all pop out. Looks like this guy has actually stuck his in with some electrical tape, which is not OEM. So now this top piece of the cowling comes up. Encouragement, there you go. And she's out. So that's the top half of the cowling. Um, then you've got to take the wiper linkage out, uh, which is quite easy. Uh, so there's one electrical plug on the wiper motor. You got two 10 mils, one here and one here, and then there's this little locating nipple, which I'll show once it comes out. This one here. can just stay in there and then once you've got it unplugged you just pull it towards the driver's side a little bit until that little lug comes out. Yeah it's not gonna let me. Let's go. There you go and there's that locating lug I was talking about so that's the wipers out. Uh, then all you've got left is one, two, three, four, five, eight, ten mils. So four of them are up here for this bracket that the wiper mount, motor mounted on. So you take these off.
comes out. Just get that set. Okay, and then you've got four 10 mils, all pretty much symmetrical. One down here, uh, one in behind. Here, I've already loosened this one because this is the most difficult one of them all to get to. On the diesels, there'll be a aluminium heat shield that runs up behind the engine and two 10 mils on these little studs just there but they're not um, obviously not on the petrols which is what this one is once you've undone those four 10 mils um, you just pull the wire off the back for the wiper motor and out it comes and then you've got heaps more space to do all sorts of things